I'm here to remind you guys to leave a like, subscribe, and drop a comment down below when you find yourself enjoying the video, because I know you will. And remember, be positive, be kind, and whatever you are, be a good one. Let's go. Hello, you beautiful souls, and welcome back to our playthrough of Pokemon, yeah, Pokemon Violet. <laughs> Should be episode uh, 13, I believe, at this point. And uh, we're just going to start off pretty much where we left off, and that is pursuing... I believe we're going to the ice badge, ice gym. Oh, wrong button. Let me just double check. Cause I'm pretty, yeah, so we're going to the ice gym. And uh, I'm not sure, I haven't checked, but the Chansey store here sold all the mints I needed from nature's. And I guess I'll give you a quick team recap. I think this might be the final, no, I don't want to say that. Cause every time I do an episode, and then I run through a bunch of raids. I'm like, oh man, that's going to be on my team for sure. But uh, we got Claude Sire. We gave him, why is he quirky? Why isn't that update? I gave him the adamant, which reflects in the stats, but he got the adamant. We got Sea Titan, which I gave him Jolly. He had some real low speed, like 30 or something like that. Uh, Rapska, I think that's how you say the name. I can't remember. Yeah, Rapska. He came as timid already, so we're we're big chilling on him. Sarah Luge, we gave him the adamant as well. We got Palmont, which we also gave the adamant. And we've got Tinkaton, who came adamant. Beautiful. Anywho, yeah, I was just checking the store out randomly about five minutes ago. And uh, I saw them all. And I figured, I've been doing so many raids. I had like 600 something K. Chilling. Look at all these candies I got. So, I, hey, why not spend some? When it comes to competitive... Sorry, I got, I'm a little stuffy after Thanksgiving. I don't know what's up. Seems like everyone has a guy a little stuffy. Um, ooh, electric terrain. What was I even saying? I can't even remember. Anyway, we're going to the gym. If we can get there. Somehow. Get there. Oh. Oh, anyway, yeah, I was. You guys haven't noticed or haven't realized it yet. There is an EV event going on in the raids. It's pretty much always up. All the levels are up. But one through four, which is what the max I can do. And uh, it's pretty much just a, a buff to rewards. You get a bunch of stuff in the rewards. Mostly, I think the main thing you're getting at four star that I've noticed is going to be calm yourself back there. Is uh, you know, the evolution stones like fire, water. Those seem to be the the big ones. And I think more XP candies. I think you get a lot more. I don't know. I looked it up, and that's kind of kind of the gist of it. There's just different rewards you can get. But I saw the blue stars and I was like, what the heck is this? I have to check it out. I guess I can boost. This is boost while we're chit chatting. So how's everyone doing? How y'all enjoying the game? I guess speaking of the game, I might as well give my opinion on it so far. Um, Overall, I like it. I'm satisfied. I like the direction they went. I like the changes. And the new implements they put into it. It feels really good. Um, and we're just talking about, you know, concepts right now. Snowscape. If I healed you, I'll heal, I guess. Visually, it looks great. It plays really good. You can tell, you know, they had a, a really good idea of what they wanted to do when they were going through the game. But then when you talk about performance wise, the game can use a little more polishing. Um, I, 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 I believe the game is playable as it is with the fall, the flaws that it has. But like I said in a couple episodes, or a couple episodes ago, there's a lot of people who are not very happy with it. Um, I can understand. I mean, the game broke records when it released. 
Because you got what glitch walks. Uh, you got certain laggy areas that probably shouldn't be that laggy. And you have some areas where you think it would be laggy, but it's not. And and I still think most of it is in the terror raids, which I can't I can't really speak on because I don't know. I really don't know the full mechanics as far as like relying on other people in the game. I'm sure there's latency things that go hand in hand with it. But there are little things like when you go to catch the Pokemon, you know, sometimes you bug out and you'd vanish and you're, there's an invisible being throwing the Pokeball. Especially when you uh, terrestrialize. Sometimes you'll vanish and be holding this you know, terror orb and whatnot. But uh, like I said, I know there's latency issues uh, between all four people. So I don't know. I don't, I don't know the coding of it. I don't know how that works. I don't know what the, you know, I don't know if you can just sit there and not do anything and everybody else can just attack. I don't know. But that's mainly where I see all the big, big faults. But, uh, I, I really love the game. I do. I think there's a huge potential here. I still believe that they can roll out a patch at some point. It may only make sense that they can be able to do such a thing to fix some of the bugs. But if they don't, I can't imagine the game being, you know, bad because of it. And I also haven't gotten into like link battles or anything like that, which coming soon. So if you want to be involved in part of that, join my discord links down in the description. Anyway, my little rant is over about the game. I'm sure I'll have a better rant later on when we explore more of the world. But for now, Nimona wants our attention. So we will suffice. It's finally time for your last gym, right? I heard from Rika. Wait, is this? Yeah, it is. We have one Titan and two uh, team leaders left. Sick. But I'm 0% worried about you. I know you got this. Even LP seems like she wants to keep an eye on you. Maybe I'll go find her so we can cheer you on together when you battle the gym leader. So go have a battle that's fruitful for you and the crowd. Thanks, Nimona. All right, so we're at the ice gym. You can't be up front. You can't be up front. You can be up front. So can you and you. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. I believe we'll be fine. I got faith. Welcome to the gym. Placido. Let me register your chat as a challenger. Oh, he has the ice. I don't think I realized they had the symbols on their jackets. This is also a different person. I believe they were all females last time. Great. Now, in order to face the gym leader, you must pass the gym test. Snow slope run. We about to do a snowboard, my dude. Ride a Pokemon down the designated course and try to reach the goal within the time limit. Start the test. Just head out to the gym and go up the slope to your left. All right. Well, I should be using Sea Toddle for this because Sea Toddle probably built for this kind of thing. For that bear tick. Bear tick's got some brakes on his chin. <laughs> All right. I want to throw sea title out there. Might as well use an ice if they allow you to. Might be like a designated Pokemon that they have. But it is what it is. I think this is the way. That is not the way. Up the slope to the left. Do I keep? Okay, here he is. Hey there, I've been waiting for you. This is the slope run to or slope run test. This is where it starts. Your task is to ride a Pokemon all the way down this course. It's like a slippery, slidey nature trail. Reach the finish line within the target time, and you'll have passed the test. So ready to attempt a gym by test by taking on the snow slope run? Yes, I am. Let's get this started. Mike, that's what I like to hear. Also, feel free to leave me your opinions on the game down below in the comment section. I will read every one of them and I will, will reply to every one of them. Okay, so we're using them right on. Let me see the little... Are you going to show me like how to do this thing or am I just winging it? I guess so we're just winging it. So we just need to make it. Bet. 
Well, you don't really move like you're on snow. Is that a fault? Is that a foul? He kind of wants to, kind of wants to move on its own a little bit. Okay, they don't go away. No. Easy does it. And then you zoom at the end for no reason, I think. Yeah, time for the gym fight. I passed. Heck yeah. Rhydon looks a little bit lighter in color in the snow. Then again, it is a dragon in the snow area. Congratulations on completing the run. That was some of the best sliding I've ever seen. Okay. Um, I think some of these gym tests don't need to be here. <laughs> some of them are just, I almost would rather have the trainers back just to get through the gym. But like, I respect the effort. Like, did we really have to take the time to slide down that hill? Uh, I mean, I don't, I don't think so. But it is what it is. Great show on the slopes. Oh no, I don't yet. I want a different lead. Give me a different Mons. All right. Uh, well, I guess we can start with Sarah Luge. We did get close combat on Pawmont, since we can't get Brick Break yet. Brick Breaks, you gotta have the defeat of the False Dragon. The last Titan. All right, I do want to face her. Let's get this thing going. Maximum load screens. All right. Well, what the heck do you want? Wah! They look like we don't have one. He's like, what is this Pokemon? There you are. I'm freezing. I take it you're a challenger. Yeah, that's right. My name's Grusha. I'm a snowboarder. Used to be pro, actually. Now I'm a gym leader. I saw you on the slopes. Your skills, yeah, they were pretty cool. <laughs> but don't let that go to your head. Why don't you take your scarf off when you're talking to me? Winter mountains are dangerous. They can throw your life right off course. Easy as that. Same thing with Pokemon battles, really. It's always the most dangerous when you're just starting to get a hang of things. Today's not a great day to face me, you know. You're better off giving up. You sure you want to battle me? Yeah. Of course I do. After all, there's no way I can go back and redo this recording. You know, Grusha? Still trying to act cool, huh? That's too bad. Well, this is my job now, so don't take what I'm about to do personally. I always take it personally, Grusha. You have what I want. You're in my way. Get ready to feel the icy bite of reality. Well. I thought she was going to take it off. All right, Gym Leader Grusha, the final gym badge. Look at you. Look at you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Not my fault if you get overwhelmed. All right, level 47. Oh my gosh. Um, this is bug ice, so this is four, four times? Should be a one shot, right? Decimation. Should know better than to lead a bug ice with me. All right, here comes C. Some I'm C. Todd, right? Bear tick. I think I just stay in. I'm pretty sure I just stay in. We don't lose this gym badge or this this battle. Not at all. All right. Oh my gosh, this one shot city. That adamant. That adamant man is nasty. I guess I wish it would reflect in the notes. I think it was even like that in Arceus. I don't want skitter smack, I don't think. It's a bug move. 
70. This also lowers the special attack of the enemy. Hmm. I mean, we're not especially... This Pokemon confuses me. We get rid of this for now. It's adamant, but it's so... It's barely ahead of the special attack when it comes to its attack. I thought this Pokemon was going to be insanely strong. You should be tanky. Yeah. I learned a thing or two. Liquidation's not good. That's not good at all. <laughs> what the heck? All right. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do now. I can't remember. Is I think Bitter Blade heals. So hopefully we can heal enough. We should outspeed it. Yeah. Maybe a crit? Okay. Alright, how much did we heal up there? Oh god. We easily beat this. Unless you crit. What was that that? Highest roll in the game, or what was that? Jesus. Um. What do I want to do here? I guess I could go Tinkerton. I will go Tinkerton. We'll get it over with here. And then we will save our Gigaton Hammer for the next Pokemon. Good ability. Can't use it twice in a row. But at least it doesn't make you recharge. I wonder if you can give this thing Iron Head. I know you can give it Metal Claw. Altaria. Yeah. Um, of course, I want to keep this one out. But now I have to remember, is Altaria a Dragon type now or when it Mega Evolves? Because that has me really wondering. It might be a dragon type now. However, it's gonna it's gonna terrestrialize into ice. So we'll just go with Gigaton. Show it to us, Grusha. Battles are like mountains in winter. The situation can change in a heartbeat. Okay. Show me what you got. That's what I'm talking about. Gigaton it out of here. Ow! Hurricane, cute. Are you gonna heal? Cause I'm using play rough. And ladies and gentlemen, that should be all oh, eight badges from the gyms. I think it's eight. Kind of lost track. The order we went in was so weird that I lost, I did lose track. <laughs> you melted straight through my ice. Well, it was bound to happen. I am me. That burning passion you have, you strive for the future, no matter what challenges you face. Just like how I used to be. Oh, never mind. I should give you your gym badge. So what's the max level now, is it? Yeah, I want a photo together. Take that scarf off your face. Come on, that's so uncool. I don't usually do that sort of thing, but... Okay, fine. Special occasion. <laughs> what are we doing? What the heck are we doing with our hands? Is she winking at me? With eight gym badges, you should be able to catch Pokemon of any level. I also listen to every word you say, whether it's cool or not. She's a cutie. Oh, and before I forget, you should take this too. Nice move we getting. Ice spinner. Oh, I thought that was a sea toddle or sea titan exclusive move. All right, should be a lot more useful than some silly photo of you and me. Feel free to stop by again. Don't mind the cold that is. 
Oh, we, we really appreciate the invitation there, Miss Grusha. So now we got to do... Oh, goodness. There they are. The duo. Sarah Lude, you did it. I'm so happy for you. This is the best. I know I said I wasn't worried, but my heart was still pounding the whole time. Most impressive. A shining display of talent, I must admit. Seriously, pat yourself on the back. You beat every single gym. Which means... Indeed. Now that you've gathered eight... Uh, la, 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 eight gym badges. All that's left is to take on the Pokemon League. If you hope to stand alongside Nimona as a fellow champion, head to the Pokemon League. That is where you can take on the champion assessment. Ba-bow. We shall come and conquer soon. Yeah, hurry up and get to my rank. I'm itching for a battle of equals. I've got to take the time while you're facing the Pokemon League to fine-tune my Pokemon's moves and revamp all my tactics. Well, good luck. And wish me luck, too. No, I'm not doing it. You're the enemy, kind of. It's unusual for me to see her so excited, though perhaps not for you. She must really be happy that she finally has a friend who can keep pace with her own talent. I think it's a little deeper than that, Gita. Gita. G. There's a special kind of strength that can only be reached by competing with a good rival. Count me among those eager to see how far you two can go. In any case, I'll be waiting for you at the Pokemon League, northwest of Mesagoza. Why, thank you. Alright. So, I am wondering, do I just beef up my mons right now? Do I just go in here and just hit them like level 80 real quick? I I don't know if I want to, to be honest. Maybe I, you know what, maybe I capped them all. At like, 50-51. For now. 51. Alright, so we're all 50, 51. Subject to change, I would say. I'm sure there's a cutscene out here. Sure of it. I've also been meaning to go back to the school and checking out what exactly we can do as far as classes go. So there's been some of these NPCs or whatever, these characters in the game who keep reminding me to take my classes. So we'll go see what's available and then if it's, uh, it's a little too boring. Then again, we are kind of showcasing our version of this playthrough. So we might just stick it out. But we'll see what they give. I would hate to like get to the end game and then I had to come back here and like be required to have A, B, and C done before I can, you know, attempt X, Y, and Z. Let's check it out. We have a lot. Like we have the biology room open. The director's chilling. The nurse's office. Classrooms. Um. Let's just go check this out. It's got an exclamation mark. Uh, hello, hello. Have you gotten used to the things here? Are two things here at the academy? Yes. Great, glad to see you're having fun. Oh, have you been using the Pokedex app? I have. I'm the one who made it, you know? Every time someone using the app catches a Pokemon, the data gets sent to me. It's really helping with my Pokemon research. So be sure to catch any new Pokemon you find and work on filling in your Pokedex. Oh, for your first goal, let's aim for, say, 30. Let me know once you've done so. Well, we're going to be here for a second. Because we've got, like, 140 or something. Here, take these. Consider it my thanks. Oh, it's false swipe. All right. Research is moving forward thanks to you. Take this as... Bruh. I am a natural catching Pokemon. I love raids. I don't have 200. I do not have 200 yet. I do have 159. Cooking, staff room. We'll go to talk to the director, see what he's up, up to. Oh, well, hello. How is your treasure hunt coming along? 
Having all sorts of fun and adventures, I hope. Yeah, that's pretty good, man. You've been there for a few of them. Wonderful. I'm glad to hear it. Do keep in mind that the treasure hunt has no set course or criteria you must follow. Simply go where your heart takes you, and you shall do splendidly. Speaking of such pursuits, there has been there has been something on my mind of late. If I could ask for your expertise on the matter, it would I would be most grateful. You see, recently I heard a word whose meaning escapes me. I believe it has been some sort of slang. Tell me, what does chugi mean? I don't know what that means. Let's go with that. I think I understand. The words used by young people these days are quite often beyond my comprehension. Yeah. Yeah, they are. <laughs> but when I learn the meanings behind the words, I find that I feel that much closer to my students. I am most grateful for your help on the font. Oh, you become closer to the guy? Let me talk to him one more time. I become even closer. So someone let me know down below. I'm not going to sit here and spam talk to this guy. Let me know down below what the benefit of becoming closer with him is. Because I have no idea. All right, what's up? You got a boo-boo. Just there. Hey there, come on in. Everyone's welcome in the nurse's office. Is it Miriam? What brings you here today? I don't see anything super wrong with you or your Pokemon. Wait, this is your first time here, isn't it? Yep. Oh, so I guess you transferred in recently. You must be Ricky, right? Everybody's been talking about you. I'm kind of, you know, kind of the hot topic right now. I can't even lie. I've heard all kinds of rumors. Apparently, you fell off a cliff right after enrolling in the academy. Ah, voice crack. I even picked a fight with Team Star. You started your treasure hunt, right? You, come tell me about everything. What? Come tell me about anything super interesting you find out there in your adventures. I'm kind of bored just sitting here all day. I don't have any classes to teach, and students only come here to skip class. <laughs> True. So yeah, drop by if you can. Deal? Deal. Yeah, so apparently you build a relationship with these peoples. Had I known that, I probably would have came here towards the end of each episode. So I assume, and I could be wrong, if there's an exclamation point up, then they are ready to pretty much, I don't know, become closer with us? That makes sense. Jibber jabber. All right. Is that it? What classes would you like to take? Um. What the heck does this even do? Oh, just like that. They escort us right into the classroom, huh? Super cool. I wonder if we'll be, like they'll make us battle. Weren't you just say hello to our battle instructor, the one, the only, the hot-blooded Dendra? Um, Osu is a karate thing, by the way. Look it up. My age, twenty-five. My hobby, working out. My type, well, Ricky BTG. Strong and muscular fighting types, of course. Did I say strong? That's all for my introduction. As for my class, this is where you all get to learn the nitty gritty of Pokemon battling. We'll start with the basics so that no trainer gets left in the dust, even if you're new to the stuff. Have no fear. Leave it to me and my muscles, and you'll be pros in no time. Let's set out. Let's set our fighting spirits ablaze together. Pokemon have all kinds of attack moves, and we all kind of know this already. Categories, we get it. Higher power means more damage. Question coming your way. There are two categories that attack moves can fall under. What are they? Like you had to ask. Awesome. I expect a new kid. Physical and special. All right. 
<laughs> I'm so sorry for including this in the in the playthrough. This is like beginner stuff. You do this before you leave the school. In conclusion, and Pokemon that are good with physical moves should raise their attack stat. Special attack for physical or special moves. All right, well, that's pretty much that. Oh, but we can take the cooking class at some point and probably learn about the sandwiches, I'm assuming. Which I got no clue about. None. I know what they do, but I don't know anything about the uh, ingredients or even where to get them. I think you get herba, the herbs from raids. I believe. I think level five raids or six. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. All right. Anyway, our next fight is going to be. Let's see. We just beat this. This will be our next opponent. Hmm. I have this feeling like Tinkerton runs this. And I have this feeling. Why are we back in the map? Cloud Sire runs that too. We have a pretty decent team. If we weren't using, if I wasn't going with only Chaldean Pokemon, making a solid team would be like way easier. But I'm so picky on appearance as well that we're a little limited. I think I used the new Tentacruel for like raid battles. But I just couldn't get behind it. I thought about adding Bellabolt in place of Palmot. And then Palm out, learn close combat, so I kind of get rid of that completely. But yeah, Toad's Cruel. What a weird mon. Pretty fast. It has the same base attack as special attack. Oh, I don't know. But once we get past the main storyline and we can start, you know, making teams and all that good stuff, then, uh, well, it's going to be a lot more versatile, a lot more. Well, it's a lot more competitive in general. So, I know this is probably a short one today. One gym fight, all the gyms down. But if you uh, if you guys did like this one, make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, drop a comment down below. Like I said, next time we will be taking on the fairy team leader. And until then, I'll see you on the next one.